Well, good evening to you wherever you are in the world. We are just about ready for the action here. Kickoff is imminent. The teams indeed with us very soon, having exchanged their various pleasantries. What I have to tell you is that the weather may not be great for the duration of the evening. The clouds yet to open, but one suspects that they will pretty shortly. And when the rain comes, we are warned to expect plenty of it. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. And we rise now for the Serbian national anthem. Although it's got the juices flowing, and now this. Norway have gone with what looks like an orthodox 4-4-2, Jim. Well, the modern version of that is a lot more fluid and flexible than in bygone times. There is a much greater understanding of the need for players to cover forward running and it enables risk-taking while the gaps are filled. I'm, I'm very much a fan of it. There are a lot of people who seem to have kind of ignored it and just put it to bed, but it still works, it's still valid and I think we're going to see it be successful here. So off we go then. Forward it goes. Well played, he saw that coming. Lajic. Tries to get it forward quickly. And try as they might, they just couldn't get into an attacking area. Johansson and here's King aimed in towards the centre goalkeeper's ball hoists it forward he's had a goal And it's Tadic. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Yeah, he's fouled in there. He's having a go. And he just whacks it away. Well, up to Lawi. Very well to get to that. Well, as test goalkeeper, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Norway, very much the team that started on the front foot. I know it's still early, but they're showing the better signs. No caution from them. Salmas. Chance to break. He's picked him out. Chant hits one. Goal, Norway. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled.
A 1-0 lead established. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Rukovina. Just starting to get the first signs of rain here. Rukovina. Could try cutting inside here. And that's been levered clear. Well, it's a scoreline to raise the eyebrow. 1-0 to the underdogs. And it's played forward. King! Oh, that was no routine save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Hoists it forward. Bajic tries to switch the play. Johansson plays it forward. Lajic. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Oh, that's neat. Finds himself eased off the ball. And it's King. Now the counter. King gets it out to the wing. Right through the middle. Now it's King. In for a header. He has done it. And there's the goal they've been looking for. Norway are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. Things starting to look very comfortable. Well, with this kind of authority, Peter, why not push on and, and totally kill this off? Tosses into the box. And that's been one straight back. Serbia are taking a simple modern approach here. Yeah, but I'm all for simplicity, Peter. If it works, it's good enough. Norway are in control here on the brink of half time. Lajic. Oh, no question, that's a foul. Well, that looks like a final warning, still no card. Good ball, it's found its target. Salnas, forward it goes. Well, that's where he wants it. Lajic. And they've reached half time. Reflections on the first half. Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why did them from here when they can repeat their first half success with a, another show of strength? 
Norway go in at half time on a comfortable two goal cushion. Here we go again. Savage. And here's Mitrovic. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if he didn't have people nearby. King. Well, they could break here. Johansson. Salnas. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Has a pop! Yes! And they are cruising away. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. He's made it three. Quite a day at the office for him. Oh, he's been unstoppable in this match. Every single time he's been in possession, he's looked a threat. Norway take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. to get it forward quickly and he's managed to beat absolutely everyone played in with accuracy he's made sure that that won't get through Savage and it's Mitrovic quick pull forward Ball. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Tadic. Omar Al Abdullawi drives it forward. Lajic. Loses his balance and loses the ball. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Well, it was a chance, but meat and drink for the keeper. Lajic cannot really be faulted for having a go. He's usually more capable. Just brushed off the ball there. And it's played forward. Hoists it forward. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Forward it goes. Cuts it out. Lajic. And here's Tadic. Has a hit! Oh, 
that is an awful miss. All he'd be thinking is, please, ground, swallow me up. Activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Omar Al Abdelawi has created one goal already. Talk about singling someone out. Well, better late than never, Peter. Although it may not apply in this case um, after a hat trick. Cross deflected behind for a corner. but not quite good enough. Across the field it goes. Kolarov. Kolarov. There's a long ball. That'll be a throw-in. Lajic. And that's left him on the seat of his pants. Oh, whistle's gone. Now then. And that really is the last thing they wanted to do. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal there. Oh, he saved it! Well, it's always worrying that the psyche is affected after a, a missed penalty. And it's King. A really good feat from him. Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. Savage. A buccaneering run from the defender. So who's he picking out? Here's Tadic. It's Tadic! Disappointing finish in the end. Shows there will be three extra minutes. And the shot! And he's lifted it over. Lajic. Kolarov. Kolarov. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. A forward pass. And that's it. Norway are irresistible here. Dominant, utterly ruthless. Only ever one result, a comfortable win. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Norway will be thrilled by this, even though they would have been a tad fearful of their, their lesser strength. <laughs>